Meanwhile, the DPP's task force against vote buying paid its first reward today to an individual who reported vote buying. The reward was earned after the suspected vote buyer was detained by prosecutors. The head of the DPP's Jai County chapter, Lin Chiu Gui, collected a $100,000 reward check on behalf of the person who reported vote buying. The informant told the DPP anti-vote buying hotline that Shuishang Township Council Chairman Wu Peiyu of the KMT was buying votes and earned the reward when the suspect was detained. Our friend used the 0800-389-399 hotline, our headquarters anti-vote buying hotline, and we pass the information to prosecutors and met the guidelines of the DPP's encouraging people to report vote buying. The DPP also accused KMT Chairman Eric Ju of not explaining the many rumored incidents of vote buying among KMT candidates. In counties and cities governed by the KMT, prosecutors seem more passive in going after vote buying. So we believe that's why the people's eyes are the most discerning. The 24-hour hotline received 20 reports of vote buying last month. If the cases lead to final convictions, the DPP will pay an additional reward of 2 million NT dollars.